Do not get the brand new iOS 18 beta 3 update because after downloading it, your iPhone may not work properly. So in this video, I'm going to be covering some of the major glitches that exist in iOS 18 beta 3 and why you should wait until iOS 18 fully releases to the public. So first off, with iOS 18 beta 3, a lot of the applications on the iPhone don't work properly. And this may especially be a big problem if this happens with a banking application. So you want to try avoiding that as much as possible. And this could also happen with other apps. So for that reason, getting the new iOS 18 beta 3 update could be really risky for your iPhone. And another glitch that I've noticed with iOS 18 beta, not just beta 3, is that your iPhone does overheat a lot and you do lose battery pretty fast. I actually do have a video on how you can fix the battery draining in iOS 18 in the description. So if you want to check that out, be sure to watch it. And battery draining has been a pretty big problem to me because I haven't been able to use my iPhone all day without needing to charge it. Versus before, I was able to just charge my iPhone once a day and, we, and it would be perfectly fine. Now, oftentimes when I use certain apps, I get notifications on my iPhone telling me that my iPhone is overheating. And another problem with this update is that sometimes I get a notification telling me that my iPhone is overheating whenever I use certain apps. And this is a problem because it's been happening a lot more than it has been in the previous iOS 18 beta updates. Also, another small glitch that has bothered me with iOS 18 is that there's a lot of lag whenever I do basic stuff, like when I type, it would sometimes glitch. And Apple will fix all this before iOS 18 is fully released to the public. So I recommend you all to wait up until September when iOS 18 is fully released to everyone. So that's basically it for this video. I hope you all found this video helpful. And if you did, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out my channel to see more videos like this in the future. And if you have any video suggestions, be sure to leave them in the comments below. And comment below any questions that you might have.